Wow, you really motivated me. Yeah. Hey. Well, come in, I guess. <laughs> no, you're not you. Not Yay. you. Piece of paper, but it's part of the games and you will be involved in some way. And whether you get wet or not, well, I'm not held responsible. Right, okay, so welcome to this year's Fairy Olympics. Oh, for the love of God. Come on! Yay! I really appreciate it for these guys taking part because it's absolutely sweltering in here. So, you know, I'm half, God knows what they're like at the moment. So, um, This is our, 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 our referee, so Frosty. Yay! Yay! They don't like you. What, what do you say to that? <laughs> That's the <it. laughs> Was that a rip? Right, so un unlike the um, unlike the first fiasco, this one's a little bit more of a structured event. So we've got teams of fursuiters uh, participating in some games for you. Um, it's quite chaotic. Um, just to let you know, one of the games you will need the corridor to remain clear. So you've got your bags or anything, just to make sure that they're kept to the side during that game. And I will warn you. Um, so without further ado, we'll get started. Um, I'll introduce you to Team A. Which is Axel and Wolfball, please. <laughs> that was good event to climax, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> you could give it to us if you like, yeah. whatever you want to. Okay. I'm not sure if I like them. I'm trying to give you something to do. <laughs> And they're up against Team 8, which is Kimu and Foxby. Yay! Kimu and Foxby! Yay! Right, we're just having some more items randomly distributed around the room. First, you just here have been involved in some horrendous criminal activity. Which believe? Never. Yes. Yes. And what they've got to do is basically between the well, you'll we'll take it in turns to run out and collect the item of evidence that we've distributed around the room. And in looking, it actually looks quite bad because even I can't see where they are. <laughs> don't hide them under your butt or anything. Yeah, you know, keep them fairly well available. If you've just been handed one of the items that have been distributed, what well, they you need to give them up willingly, and they need to be very visible so people can see them. So what you guys need to do is one at a time when we call out the item that you need to go and collect you just go out into the audience find this piece of evidence and get it back to the stage for each round the fastest to get it back to the stage and win that round pretty straightforward yes yes i'm not doing it so it sounds brilliantly straightforward <laughs> right the first item that you'll need to go and collect is a tommy gun <laughs> <laughs> Fox is always early. <laughs> he's really got a high yeah, because he's very cheap. What? Three second penalty. <laughs> Referee society. <laughs> so, our RC refs will start the round. So, it's a Tommy gun. You're looking to collect a Tommy gun. And go! <laughs> <laughs> I think they made the miscommunication in the fastest back to the stage with it wins. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that, that looks like to me that was round one to team A, which I is uh, Axel and Wolfball. <laughs> okay, so for this round, you're looking for a cleaver through the head. Uh, a cleaver <laughs> through the head. It's like a knife. 
A knife through the head. So you might remove it for this round, <laughs> because otherwise our first users will. If you do value your headband, please take it off now. <laughs> See, that's the same question I was asking. We don't know what a Charleston headband is. A Charleston headband is. is what the flappers wear. So it's a, it's a band round your head and it's got a feather sticking out the top. Feather out the top. Does that help? Does that help? Look for a thing with a feather sticking out. Anything with a feather, yeah. Anything with a feather. <laughs> <laughs> Are we good? Three, two, two, one, one go! <laughs> Axel and Wolf for the one, that one. Yeah, I think give him yeah. bonus points. Start points. You're too sure. Very pleased. Oh. <laughs> I'm having a flashback to last Thursday. <laughs> no. yeah. Were you in that bar in Manchester? <laughs> Do I owe you 20 pounds? More! 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 This is why you should never drink alone. Bad things happen. You're probably looking at the sheet now seeing lots of question marks. There are lots of question marks in this next game, which is a very confusing situation to be in. Basically, the next item you're looking for is a regular sort of door or hat, so it's got a white band round. Again, if you've got your own on, you might want to remove it for this round. It has to have the white band around the hat. So, are you ready? I think they can see them. Two, Three, two, one, one go! go. <laughs> 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 so I think that was Kimu that got that first air. I think so. Ref, Ref. So Kimu. Yes, it's a nod, it's a nod. It's Kimu who was first back for that round. That's two. Hey. There's still question marks. Yes, you can tell at the last minute this game was. <laughs> no, it was just a surprise for me, wasn't it? Plan. Basically, you're now looking for another fedora hat without the white band. How original. Without the white band, it all comes down to this, and whoever's the first bat will win. This is the last round. So are you ready? Three, two, Three, two one, one, go! go. <laughs> That's not one of them! <laughs> Yes. 
We do, we have a winner, I believe. So it was 3 2 to Foxby and Kimu. Hamul Paul, you are out. But don't worry, because we've got these really non cheap, fantastic. Wow. 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 So here you go. Thank you very much for taking part, and our referee will. <laughs> it's so cheap. It's so cheap. <laughs> Let's have a round of applause, please, you guys. Thank you. Old. Maybe we should get you one as well. No. I'm okay. Oh, yeah. Wait. <laughs> okay. 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 Team G, which is JD Puppy and Jimmy Wolf. Right, if you are currently sat on a chair with a white piece of paper, oh please hold this up very clearly with the writing facing the stage. Oh, it includes all right. Yes, yours, yours as well. Are you confused yet? Are you confused yet? Pete, please, Bob. Oh, I agree. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Now that I've had that very in-depth briefing of how this game works, we're going to have five separate rounds, and we're going to ask the teams to go and fetch a letter, a very particular letter, the one we asked for from the audience. <laughs> oh God! It will spell a word. Yes, don't tell them what the word is. <laughs> it's a word with letters in it. <laughs> I'm not telling you anything. Basically, the idea of this one it guys, doesn't have a six in it. It's for each one of you to take in turn for each round. So you're going to go down. You're not going to collect the letter, by the way. You're going to collect the person. Oh, I've got a the person who needs to come back to the stage. <laughs> okay, that you left out. That's because if I said that, this one would have changed seats. <laughs> so that's a surprise for you. Again, I know standards of education are swindling in this country. That's the V. Yeah. <laughs> so once you've collected your person and letter, you need to have them on your side of the stage. Each team to get that person back to the stage the fastest wins that round. <laughs> Is that just sat there recording? Yeah, I'm recording. Oh, do I get a chance to publicly hmm? humiliate somebody else? To one side, just, just in case you grab it. A goes that way. <laughs> That's it. I don't care. Right. <laughs> so, let's have them all held up high then. And the first letter you need to go and collect is A. <laughs> we need to wait for the ref to say it's okay. He's never going to say it's okay. The ref is unhappy. Tell him off. Oh, you've been dismissed. Red card. <laughs> Okay, he's giving you a second chance. Boo! Boo! <laughs> I'm with you. So, Three, two, one. Oh. Oh. Take him to the stage! They have to get to the stage! Mind the camera. Okay, I think that one was quite obvious, isn't it? You and Tiggs won that round. Yeah. The test is for the letters. You can stand back against the wall from time in. But keep your letter held up. Press, please. Next letter. Can I have a letter? You can have a letter. Can I, does it have to be a letter that's in the actual word? Yes. It would help. Okay. The next letter you need is the letter I. <laughs> I. I. It's like a. I. I. Three, two, one. Go! Go! <laughs> 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 <laughs>
I'm going to hide behind the Germans. <laughs> Which is to say, by the way, if you get injured, I think you signed some sort of release policy when you, when you register to do fly. <laughs> so, okay, I think that was Hugh and Tiggs again. I think so. So, round two to Theo and Tiggs again. Yeah. Hmm? Place to put it, man. Okay. Next letter you're looking for. Next letter is M. M for mother or mom. Or minestrone. <laughs> or minestrone. Or oh, mamma mia! So M. So you read all the efforts to think something in context and they get shot down. <laughs> Bloody hell. Three! Three! Two! Go! 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 <laughs> I think the wrong side of the stage is stand on this. People keep running at me. This is more dangerous and chaotic than I anticipated. Yes. I think next year it calls for safe death. This is structure for safe death. At least they're not getting wet. Yes. Now that, that's tomorrow. What will be later? Good luck. Next letter. Oh, yeah, well, that was Tix and Q again. They, they won that round. That's, yeah, round of applause. Tix and Q. Next letter. Now we've had three, haven't we? We've had an M. We've had an A. And an I. Yeah. 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 So you're looking for the letter F. <laughs> Three, two, one, go! go. go. Call that one, Ras. Um, who, who owns the letter? <laughs> do you? No, they've got to get another one. You've got to get another F. <laughs> another F. <laughs> I think in that round, we'll let these guys have that. That was a, that was a vicious rugby tackle right at the end to sabotage. You can have a seat. So that one was Jimmy Wolf and JD Puppy, please. The last letter, the last letter, A. I think it is A. 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 It's the letter A. This show is sponsored by the letter. Three, no, two, two, one, go! <laughs> <laughs> but you guys at the back, we sincerely apologise. <laughs> so yes, that, that was a round for, for JD and Wolf, Jimmy Wolf again. <laughs> right, guys, you're going to have a problem for this round. You're missing a letter. You're missing a letter. 
you almost got the right idea. So, to win this game, it's clever pegging, I think, isn't it? What's the score? No, 3 2. 3 2 2. Uh -huh. Tixing Q, isn't it? So this round's worth two points, basically. You've got your letters in front of you, you have to arrange it into the word. <laughs> but I think these guys figured out how this one can start. Yeah. So that, that round was just a blowout. <laughs> Go! We have a winner! We have a winner! <laughs> the word you were looking for was happier. <laughs> Sure. <laughs> so, yeah, I think yeah, that, that, that round was a bit of a loss because they threw that out and went along. They, you were collecting letters from the audience to spell the word mafia. So, Tiggs and Q. Well done! Hey. Thank you, Mr. <laughs> JD, Jimmy. You have to take the walk of shame, I'm afraid. Let's have a round of applause, please. I think it's not bad. And guys, thanks very much. I'm sorry it was so violent. <laughs> no cuts and bruises at home. Thanks very much. Let's have a round of applause, please.